So we have the first appearance of the sun. It must be about 5.10 The first appearance of the sun from this vantage point, that is. Looking at the the Earth from the flat Earth perspective, the flat Earth theory, the Sun has simply circled back on us. So it didn't set. It doesn't rise, but it circles. Or more correctly, it coils. Yes, this is reverse engineering. When you look at the flat earth theory, it's not all the planets that coil behind the sun. It's simply the sun that coils up and down above the earth or above the earth's flat plane. So a new perspective In the flat earth theory, the sun isn't a gigantic ball 93 million miles away, but a, but a a glowing disk some 33 miles wide coiling above a flat plane so in the heliocentric system the Sun is enormous in comparison with the Earth. But the in the flat Earth theory, the Sun is minuscule in comparison with the Earth. A complete reversal. So there we have it. Our sunrise on a flat world. 517 and the sun is circling back on us this morning. sun circling back in reflection. 
So now we're going to have a look at the sun at solar noon. That's five past one. Thirteen hundred hours and five. On the 14th of June, 2021. And we're going to look at this, the sun because this is solar noon and it should be directly overhead. Yes, it should be according to the flat earth map. We go around the circle that is called the tropic of cancer which is between us and the arctic circle so if we just look straight up the sun's not straight up it's at a slight angle yes so that's now going around the the Tropic of Cancer and we can ask some serious questions from this point because it's traveling between 100 and 200 miles an hour and so you can ask yourself at what time will it be over Florida Yes, according to the flat earth map it's now heading for Florida so how many hours will it take for it to get there and uh, at noon in Florida or solar noon how many hours away is that so the sun is just over there here we go. And it's kind of a special day today. So I'd just like to say happy birthday to John, a friend I've known for many years. Happy birthday, John. So here we are, 21 morning, 9 Nice wind. And as we see the sun is certainly going to the the right of these buildings.
that the sun is not on the earthly plane. decided to change everything.
eclipse of the sun. miles away, somewhere over Florida at the moment. sunset so far. saying I'll circle back on that. I'll circle back. Is she trying to say something? Without knowing what she's saying? Thank you. 
speed that the sun is moving and the distance it is covering. those clouds and we're just seeing the glow. And as a plus we have the moon just up there. Up there. Kind of the same place it was last night. see it. Beautiful. <laughs> and it feels really like velvet. Fire. 
that's a good example of perspective actually. I mean, the top of that mast of, of the, the boat, the ship that the, on the spire, is much higher than the tower, which we know to be much higher. It's just perspective. for another shipley eclipse of a sunset or a shipley eclipse of a circle back catch you later the moon up there should be at 12% luminosity this evening. I'd have to check that on the chart. sunset. So basically, from 1304, 1305, it's moved from up there, circling all the way over to America, over to Florida.
This is the state of affairs after a four minute pause. And once, once again, after another four minute pause, this is the scene. And finally at 9.45, after another four minute pause, this is the scene. Twenty-one fifty-one. Twenty-five. Unfortunately, we won't be able to see any stars because of the clouds. But the moon, we can see through some cloud cover, similar to last night. <laughs> 